Welcome back to Best Blueprints. And today we're talking about T squares and the history of vellum. Book script genius. Give me the right one. Welcome back to Best Blueprints. And this is the first video with the season four blueprints. There's so much new ground loot, so many blueprints in the new battle pass, new bundles. It is busy here at Best Blueprints, but I have a whole team getting content for us this season. It's literally and just you. Lenny! Both of today's blueprints are from the season four battle pass. I recommend them, so let's dig in. Starting out, we have the Flower Power, a legendary blueprint for the Milano and acquired at tier 65 on the new battle pass. I find this blueprint quite fun. I know it's got the 60s and the groovy skin and everything to it, but I like it quite a bit. It worked out well. It was able to get kills. I know that the Milano has been kind of a joke in Warzone ever since its release. In this update, they did buff it and it has become a much more viable option for you if you happen to pick one up in the game. They are now scattered all over Verdansk as ground loot. This blueprint comes with the agency suppressor, which actually works out quite nice for the vertical recoil control and the sound suppression. Comes with a snap point optic on this one. You could change it out, but you're gonna lose all your matchy matchy. The tactical stock here is boosting that aim walking movement speed, which is helpful with this gun. Once again, it is suffering from not enough bullets in the clip. I don't know why they keep making these submachine guns with a minimum clip size. I don't understand this at all, but it seems to be very common. Maybe they like the way it looks, but it's not functional at all. And lastly, the bruiser grip to help with your movement speed and your hip fire accuracy. All of this is working well. I know I hate the magazine size, but I did get kills with it and it didn't really cause me to die that much because of it. It is a quick reload. The Vandal speed loader does help with all of that. Here is the high stakes blueprint, an ultra blueprint for the MG82. This one is unlocked at tier 95 on the season four battle pass. If you just sit back and look at it, this is one of the better and more fun blueprints that we've ever had around here with the casino theme, all the different things happening, the slot machine, the jackpot, the lights that go in and out the martini glass neons everything is on point for the theme i love everything about this skin this gun is so much fun while everybody's out there running around talking about how broken it is i'm over here really enjoying this blueprint that we have for it it's quite nice the infantry compensator does help with your vertical recoil control even though this gun is labeled as a zero recoil gun for the most part the cavalry lancer barrel here is there could be a better barrel, let's just say that. The aim down to sight speed here is gonna get you killed one or two times. It does have a five milliwatt laser on it. That does seem to help the hip fire a little bit when you can use it. This blueprint is running the 150 round mag, which works really well. I definitely had moments where I couldn't afford the time to reload this thing. So I was happy to have the extra rounds. And last but not least, it comes with the ANPVS4 Thermal Optic. I know this thing is probably not used that much. I had a lot of fun with having just a thermal sight on something like this, especially a thermal sight like this one. It really added to the fun I had running around with this blueprint. You're more than welcome to switch out the thermal optic to something else, but I like the matchy matchy and it actually worked. Coming up later, we're going to be reviewing all the ground loot and which guns you should pick up and which ones you should just kick down the road. 